everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And today I'm over at Regency at Summerlin, a 55 plus retirement community. And stay tuned to have a couple other walkthroughs that I'll be posting soon. But my clients will be closing next week, so we just did a very thorough walkthrough. They are out of state, so I videotaped it for them. They purchased this beautiful Sundance model. It was a spec home, so everything that was in this house was already selected for them. And the Sundance model has three bedrooms, like a den area, two and a half bathrooms, and it's 22, 23 square feet. It's one of the most popular models here in Regency. So it's pretty interesting. I love this beautiful door. And let's go check it out. It's kind of an overcast day, so I have all the lighting on. Sorry if it looks a little dark. As you walk in, you have this big great room. You have a bedroom one here and bedroom two there, and then the whole house. So in bedroom one, just simple bedroom. Love the windows, the recessed lighting. And throughout this video, I will also post the whole walkthrough with the um, builder. So that way you can learn all about this awesome home. You know, when you do final walkthrough with the builder, you'll come in, put blue tape everywhere, make sure everything's just perfect. And then maybe a few days later, they fix all of these items and then you come back and make sure that all the items that you wanted fixed and touched up is taken care of. So here's the half bath right here. So both, there's two bedrooms that have a bathroom attached to it, this one in the primary. And then you have this large, you can make it into a dining room, you can make it into an office, whatever you wanna do. I've seen some models where they put like glass enclosure right there. That way you can still get some natural light, but it's closed off, just FYI. Then you have the nice great room with all can lighting, pre-wired for ceiling fan. And then this awesome, awesome, awesome kitchen. Love the options that the um, Toll Brothers has selected for this home. So a spec home basically is how Toll Brother operates, especially at Regency, is they'll pick a couple of lots. The agents will pick the customization of it and then they'll build it. Once it's reached its probably drywall phase or once the cabinets are in, they'll list it and put it for sale. So you can't change any of the structural options or any of the options that have been selected in this home. But the nice thing is, is that these agents really choose some nice options. So they chose this nice two and a quarter inch um, quartz countertops. I love this flat panel. I think it's like a veneer, which is in trend. Um, looks like nice wood, little accents that they picked. The appliances are awesome. The pantry area, the cooktop with vent, range hood. The microwave is back ordered, so that's why we have a hole here. And then also you have a double oven. And then I love all this extra cabinetry. The ceilings, he said, are probably 14 feet tall. And then we'll take a look at outside shortly. We'll just finish the tour of the house and then we will. And here's the laundry room with the same cabinetry, Petrofina, a nice sink. I mean, the selections, look at this flooring, it's beautiful. And then this is the entry to the primary. They have an alarm system set up in here the beautiful carpeting that was selected, the large windows, the tray ceiling, all the can lighting, a recessed lighting, and the backyard. It's a very large room. Two Echo B thermostats right here is one in the primary and then the other one is in the hallway. Then you have this beautiful I want to show myself it's a rough day. <laughs> Double sink with a beautiful marble. This marble is absolutely gorgeous. 
and then the nice don't look at me. Nice selections that they had selected with the honeycomb tile, the wood-like tile. It's very nice. This uh, inspector was awesome. So I will post, after this video, the next day I will post the walkthrough with the uh, builder because he went into very great detail of how all of these items operate. And another tankless water heater, plumbed for a water softener, your standard garage stuff, your water system for your lawn, blah, 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 garage door. You've seen a garage, you've seen them all, right? But the Sundance model is one of their popular models. And this is part of the Palisades collection, which is pretty much almost sold out. They only have a few lots left and not much left really of the Palisades. They do have a lot of lots left for the Summit collection, which is your smaller collection. I have about four or five homes that I've sold in here. Four new construction, one was a resale. So I know Regency pretty well. It comes with the paved backyard with the, they call it the Lagosha and it's wired for a ceiling fan. Now, most of these homes on this side will have the view fencing with a common area in between. And the interesting fact that I learned, uh, I, thought I, I thought I knew it, I probably didn't know it, was that the front yard is maintained by Summerlin West HOA or Summerlin South, I apologize. So that's pretty cool. Now, when you buy new construction, obviously the backyard is not landscaped, the front yard is. Anyways, kids, um, I think the condenser unit's on this side, sorry. So to surmise, this is the Sundance model with three bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms, two car garage over here at Regency Summerlin. Um, if you're thinking about buying, oh, it's a little over 2,200 square feet. If you're thinking about buying new construction or anything in Summerlin, I'm your go-to Summerlin gal. I know everything and anything there is to know about Summerlin. You can always give me a call at 702-370-5112. Like, share, subscribe. Have a good one, guys.